as a company, we have not been left behind. We set in as a management and put in place a prolonged strategy whereby we, our priority was to ensure safety for our employees, uh, our customers, community, and continue our business as usual. As a company, we continue to work normally because uh, what we've done is to make changes in, within our operations. We do not have any plan to lay off. We do not have any plan to get anybody who is in our payroll out of the job. Because our employees are comfortable, we've always ensured our products are on the shelf for all Kenyans. As a frontliner, like never before, the COVID-19 has come as a big surprise to each and everyone. Initially, it was a big challenge, trying to imagine or worry or get scared if I may transmit this kind of infection to my family back at home whenever I leave work. But back at work, we have this kind of teamwork. We sit down and see what needs to be done, like putting up this isolation room that is still continuing, doing the sensitization, going that extra mile to provide the psychological support to our patients, and even to one another, because we realize the fears that I have are the fears that my colleague has. So our holding area, the main purpose of it is first of all, to make sure that we have ensured that there is safety or reduce the risk of transmitting the infection to the other healthy people that could be around us, considering this is a very large company. So one thing that has to be the measure is to take this patient away from the others, but not to really isolate them, to put them in somewhere safe where they can get the best quality care as we wait for them for the next step. For the first time in my life, it has brought the real vision of what is my duty. It has come to our mind and our recollection to put forefront, especially as nurses, because we are the first contact with the patient. So it becomes an awakening call to really walk the mile. It's a bit scary, but also it gives us the confidence that we're going to do because we are skilled and we have the equipment that, and the knowledge to contact or to handle the patients.